16 of the fantasy football season. He has a few tight ends I will bench, so at the time filming this video, none of these guys have been placed on the COVID list, and none of these guys are out as of now. The first guy I will bench this week's Hunter Henry of the New England Patriots. So Hunter Henry's been a boom or bust tight end the whole season here, and he's a touchdown dependent tight end, which is fine, but it's a boom or bust, like I mentioned, the last few weeks here for Henry. Week 12 versus Tennessee, two catches, 16 yards. Week 13 of Buffalo. That was the 50-mile-per-hour win game. He had no points in that one. And then last week in Indianapolis, the two touchdowns saved him for sure. Six catches, 77 yards, and two touchdowns. But right here with a tough matchup in Week 16 versus the Buffalo Bills that give up the third least amount of fantasy points to tight ends here. I think this is going to be a grinded-out type of game like it was for both teams in Week 13. Obviously, I don't think the weather is going to be as windy as it was with 40 to 50-mile-per-hour winds. But right here, like I mentioned, this Buffalo team, they don't give up many points to tight ends. And I don't see Hunter Henry really having a big game, even if he scores a touchdown. I think he maxes out in this one at 10 to 12 fantasy points, even though that's a decent number. He's just too boom or bust for me to start him this week in a semifinals matchup. The next tight end I would bench is Tyler Conklin of the Minnesota Vikings. So Tyler Conklin, the last few weeks here... He's pretty much been phased out of the offense and not doing much. Last week, he took a monster hit early in that ball game versus the Chicago Bears on Monday Night Football. And I don't know how he got up for him. So kudos to him being a tough guy and getting up. But that's not going to get your fantasy points. The last few weeks for him, week 13 at Detroit, 7 catches, 56 yards. Week 14 versus Pittsburgh, 2 catches, 20 yards. And week 15 at Chicago, 1 catch for 7 yards. So this week here, what a tough matchup versus the Los Angeles Rams. In week 16 that give up the 13th least amount of fantasy points to tight ends on the season. I can not trust Conklin. The last few weeks he's done nothing. And he's only had one double digit fantasy game in PPR league since week 11. So right here, in my opinion, he's an easy guy to bench. Yeah, he could have a good game. But I just don't see it happening. And I can't trust him. So right now, he's a tight end I would get away from. And bench this week with him doing nothing over the last three weeks. Of the season and the third and final tight end I would bench is Evan Ingram of the New York Giants. So Evan Ingram's been a hot and cold boomer bust tight end this season for the Giants. And it wouldn't surprise me if they move on from him in the offseason here. Where I think the Giants they're gonna move on from a lot of players going into the offseason. So the last few games here from Ingram. Week 13 at Miami had a good game, four catches, 61 yards. Week 14 at the Chargers, one catch. In that one for eight yards. And then last week versus the Dallas Cowboys in week 15. Four catches, 33 yards. So right here, he's another tight end that's touchdown dependent. And I know on paper, he's got an amazing matchup versus the Philadelphia Eagles. I give up the most fantasy points to tight ends on the season. But right here, I just don't see Ingram getting the job done. I don't see him having a big game. Jake Fromm most likely is going to start in this game. So maybe that could help. Because Mike Lennon is a total scrub in my opinion at the quarterback position and was doing nothing for these giant receivers at tight ends hurting them more than anything but anyway Evan Ingram I can't trust them in a big situation and there's a reason right now where a lot of people aren't starting him in fantasy weeks because he's been inconsistent and he hasn't put up numbers this season so that's a few tight ends I would bench here in week 16 of the fantasy football season